So Derek buys a house for £150,000. He sells the house for £154,000. Work out Derek's percentage profit. So first of all, we need to work out how much money he's made, how much profit he's made. So if we do 154,500, subtract 150,000, then we will have the amount of money that he's made. So he's made 4,500 pounds of profit. So we now need to express that profit as a fraction of the amount he bought the house for. So 150 is what we started with. Four and a half thousand is what we made. And to change that fraction into a percentage, we multiply by 100. So the simplest thing to do on a calculator paper is to tap that to the calculator and get your answer, which is 3%. So the answer is 3% profit. Now, Derek Ault, Derek invests 154,500 for two years at 4% per year compound interest. We need to work out the value of the estimate at the end of two years. So the way I do this is I take the amount of money I'm investing, which is 154,500. I need to know if I'm adding on 4% per year, the decimal equivalent for adding on 4%. The decimal equivalent is 1.04. Now if you don't know why, if you have 100% and you add 4%, you've got 104%. So that's your multiplier, and 104% as a decimal is 104 over 100 which is 1.04. Now the extra bit of the question is that it's going in for two years, two years compound interest. So again, if you've been taught this well, you'll know that you need to do 1.04 times 1.04, or 1.04 to the power two. So what we need to do then is put 154,500 times 1.04 squared into the calculator to work out the value of the estimate at the end of two years. So you now see that I've inserted that calculation um, or the calculator display onto the screen and you can see that the answer then is £167,000, £107,167,107.2 pounds and that's your answer.